What's going on everybody? Welcome back to the channel. It's your boy Travis back with another video today and as you can see on the screen we are starting up a brand new series. We are on the brand new Madden. Yes, we are in Madden 25 and uh, we are starting our quarterback superstar series. Uh, this is our quarterback man. So let, let's look at our skills and what we have done we are a 6'4", 190 pound field general. Our name is Paul Crew. If you don't know what that's a reference to, it's a reference to the movie The Longest Yard. Obviously, the quarterback that uh, Adam Sandler played, uh, that, that was what his name was in the movie. So that's what we're doing. Um, I basically built, so you can kind of build out your player a little bit, uh, take certain points off, put certain points on, and uh, also adjust your frame to get higher stats in certain categories so for instance i went with the slim build because it gave me a little bit more speed uh that we can you know max out at and uh also um i also took away i think one max level from short accuracy so instead of 99 it maxes out at 94 um and i put uh one on speed so now my max speed as a field general is 91, which I think, I mean, there's plenty, uh, plenty speed for a field general, that's for sure. Uh, I took one accuracy away from deep throws, so now that max is out at 94, and I uh, put that towards uh, throwing the run, I think, uh, to put that up to an 89. Uh, so a little a little bit uh, tweaks here and there to kind of showcase my, uh, my play style to the max. I, I mean... 91 speed as a field general is very very good in my opinion um I was plenty plenty enough speed uh to do what we got to do so let's hop into this thing man we got uh we got the league coming up we already credited our player uh so we should be ready to rock so let's go ahead and start this thing up and uh see where we go man see if we can carry whatever team we got to carry and uh Let's get it. So we're going to keep force team selection off. It doesn't matter what team we go to. Hopefully we go to a team that actually needs a quarterback. That would be nice. Um, skill level, all pro, all Madden. I mean... We'll, tur we'll, turn, it we'll turn it up to all Madden since it's actually a superstar. Uh, you normally play on all pro because there's just so many like glitches here and there when it comes to all madden um I've, i'm gonna turn it down to all pro actually if it's too easy i'll turn it up uh but we're gonna start off at all pro uh and then if it's too easy we'll turn it up to all madden i feel like that is uh that's that's kind of appropriate when it comes to madden if you play on all if you play on all madden 24 7 you're just you're an absolute psycho and i just i don't know what else to say so uh, we're gonna keep accelerated clock on obviously uh we're gonna turn injuries off uh this i do not want injuries I, I don't care uh if that's unrealistic we're not here we're trying to, we're here trying to have fun all right and that's exactly what we're gonna do so let's get it man we got the combine here and uh it looks like they're already playing music so that's cool um okay See what we got here. Moments, all of these guys have been waiting for a chance to compete in front of all 32 NFL teams and convince them that they should be a first. All right, we already know what it is. So we got uh, pushed down to get ready, release to start, and then we alternate L2, R2, and then press X to dig deep. Uh, so our expected result is between a 435 and a 477. I'm guessing none of this really matters because we already have our stats set pretty much. So I don't think that really matters, but uh, let, let's see what we can do, man. I'd like to at least run a 4-4. I mean, that'd be nice. A 4-4-7, okay. I will take that. That's that's definitely uh, definitely where we should be at for sure. Uh, that looks like it's going to be the fastest uh, 40 that there is. So okay, so it's interesting. So it's grade versus expected is an A. We're at a 447. So 
it actually gave us plus five speed and plus five acceleration. Is that a permanent boost? Because that gives us that starting 86 speed and a starting uh, 83 acceleration. So, I, I, I mean, I'll take it, but... Alright, so... Uh, bench press, we already know how to do this. It's been uh, in for a good little bit. Uh, so, instead of... Okay, so instead of replenishing stamina with L2, R2, it's actually L1, R1 this year. Okay, so let's let's do it. Let's see what we can get, man. I'm excited to see. Six, we're doing pretty well. We were expected 7 to 11, so let's see if we can smash that. We trade for this combine. We're ready. We're ready, coach. Ah! I messed that one up. Seventeen on the I don't know if I can get another one up. Ah, nope. Alright, we got 20 reps. That's gotta be one of the strong I mean I don't know. We'll see. I mean Austin Reed put up 18. 18 for Spencer Rattler, 17 for Joe Milton. So being number one, definitely we will take that. That adds five to strength and five to stamina. We'll take that. So we build up power by rapidly pressing uh, X, and then we try to launch at the angle. Well, fan, All right. Let's get it. I don't know what it was expected right there, but 10-7, that's got to be good. That's got to be good. Oh. Oh, so Joe Milton got a 10-4. JJ McCarthy with a 10 flat. Our expected was 9-3 to 10-4. So jump goes up to a 75. We'll take that. 20-yard shuttle. Uh run by rapidly pressing. So okay, I remember doing this. Uh I remember doing this one last year as well. So let's get it. Got the regular Nike zooms here. Four two two. Okay, I, I don't know if that's gonna be the best. Oh, just under the best, just beating out Michael Pratt. We will take that. Four two six four five five was our expected, so that just puts our by change of direction. So I don't know if these are temporary boosts or if these are permanent boosts, but we'll take every bit of it. This has got to be our our throwing one, right? Here we go. Alright. Let's get it. That's one. Good catch from the receiver there. Boom. Boom. Easy money. What was that? That was so weird. Come on, man. All right, we missed. We missed one so far. Ah, uh, that's too short. Ah, uh, six of eight. I don't like it, man. I don't like it. Does that mess up our stats? I don't know if that messes up our stats or not. That's called ending your combine strong. He got out there with plenty of confidence. Okay. All right. So grade versus expected is a B. It doesn't say that it. Oh, let me see if I can get a. Let me see if I can get a better result here and see if it actually helps something out. All right, we got an eight out of eight. So let's uh, let's see if that uh, is enough to get things done here.
Um, I don't know if it gives us anything. Okay. Yeah, so we pretty much did that for nothing. That's fine. Whatever. Um. There, I guess there was there was no overachieving the drills because it it was expected result was four of eight. So it is what it is, man. I did everything right. I got first and everything. I got eight for eight on the drills. Uh, so let's uh, let's see what we got here. Uh, see where we go. I mean, I would be very surprised if I didn't uh, get uh, at least top three, maybe. Um, but uh, we'll see. So we got. Uh, Looks like we got four skill points. I think I'm going to go ahead and... I think I'm just going to go ahead and add three straight away to our throw power. Uh, I'm, I'm, I'm a throw power junkie, man. I, I think that's one of the most important things. So let's, uh, let's do that straight away. And then, uh, and then we'll do short throw as well. All right, let's go to equip abilities. It looks like we cannot get an X Factor yet. We have the slot open, but we just can't get it yet. So uh, that's fine. Let's go back. And uh, all right, I think that's good. I think we're good to go here. So uh, let's see if we can go to uh see where we go in this draft man uh combine interview okay let's get it uh several teams are interested in conducting a brief interview if you can impress them with your football knowledge you may find yourself moving up the draft board it's completely optional entirely up to you what do you say now i never played organ organized football uh Played in, uh, obviously, Backyard with Friends. Uh, so I, as far as the X's and O's goes, I'm not sure. Uh, so uh, let's just go ahead and participate nonetheless. And uh, see what we can do to uh, to improve my draft stock even more. Uh, this may be bad. I don't know how in-depth they've gone with these questions, but let's see. Uh, the media will put your NFL knowledge to the test since interview if uh, it consists of time since and multiple questions. Your results will impact draft stock and cannot be retaken. Uh, Adrian Reeves was beat out in a fan vote by what Hall of Fame running back to be on the cover of Madden 25th anniversary edition? Uh, that was Barry Sanders, but Adrian Peterson was also on the cover of the next gen one, so it didn't matter. Uh, which NFL legend officially retired at the end of the 2023 season? Um, am I crazy thinking that it's. Uh, it's Aaron Donald, right? Didn't Tom Brady retire in 2020? I don't know. I'm not good with years. Uh, what team is known for mastering the tush push? That would be uh, the Eagles. Um, in 2000, who was the first player to appear on the cover of Madden without Coach Madden also on the cover? Uh, that would be uh, Mr. Eddie George. What state is not home to an NFL team? Uh, Baltimore, Denver... Uh, Atlanta, so that would be Oklahoma. What does RPO stand for? It stands for uh, run pass option. How many timeouts does a team get per half? Uh, that would be three. What teams traded for the Stephon Diggs in the 2024 offseason? That would be uh, the Texans. Chad Johnson led the NFL in receiving yards in 2006 as a member of what team? Uh, that would be the Cincinnati Bengals. Who's the NFL's all time leader in receptions? Receiving yards and receiving touchdowns. That would be uh, the man himself, Jerry Rice. So we got ten out of ten. Uh, that that one that one question about the retirement kind of messed me up a little bit. I'm not gonna lie. I was because I knew Aaron Donald just retired, but I was like, I, I'm pretty sure Tom Brady was the year before. So uh, we got a tweet over here, one to watch. Are we looking at the next pitch of Michael Vick and Paul Crew with a 40 yard dash time of four four seven? Uh, no, we are not. I am not Michael Vick, but I am fast. So let's get it, man. Let's see where we go. We're projected top three. I did everything right. I aced every drill. Uh, so let's see where we go.
Okay, so it looks like we are going to the Bears. Uh, the Bears have the number one overall pick. Uh, so I'm guessing... Wait, are we going third? The first pick... Okay, so we are first pick to the Bears. Now, this is very interesting. Are they still are we still gonna have Caleb Williams on the roster? Or is Caleb Williams gonna actually go to a different team? I mean, I, I wish I wish Madden would actually do this kind of stuff right. Um, and you know, I I, I wish that Caleb Williams would actually go to a different team. Um, just to make things cool, man, to be able to uh, compete against Caleb Williams. But I feel like uh, Madden, as they always do, it won't matter. Caleb Williams will still be on the team, and uh, everybody else will still be on the team. So I don't think it's really going to matter. So uh, here we go. Four years, $36.8 million for the first overall pick. 600 credits per game, 600 XP per game. Uh, let's go ahead and sign this thing. We have no other option but to sign it. Uh, so let's go ahead and sign that thing real quick. And we are now with the Bears, man. We got a good squad. Uh, we have a real good squad. I can see this being a really good year. Uh, we got uh, Ken Allen, DJ Moore, Roma Dunze, DeAndre Swift, Cole Komet. We got a good team. So uh, let, let's see what else we got here. Um, I don't know what's going to happen with Caleb Williams. I don't know. I'm interested to kind of see what happens. So it's like we're in a team meeting here. Welcome to Chicago. We're glad to have you here. Uh, excited to be a part of this. We've had our struggles here. Yes, y'all have. Uh, but that's all in the past now. We're turning a new page, starting fresh. I'm all in. I'm all in, coach. turn this organization around and uh what do you hope to focus on in the preseason uh just being accurate man just want to work on just making sure we're accurate that's all that's all i care about that's why i kept my medium accuracy at 99 um and then i i, I, I didn't mind taking one off of short accuracy and deep accuracy uh, just for the simple fact that medium, I feel like we make a lot of medium throws. Um, but we also, I feel like medium throws are also the ones that we, you miss the most, uh, normally in, uh, in Madden, you normally miss those the most. So, uh, it looks like we finally can head into our very first game. It is a preseason. So technically if we wanted to, we could advance to the regular season. I just don't know if we're going to play. I'm guessing we are. So, yeah, so I, that's what I thought. We still have Caleb Williams on the team. Uh, we are a 66 overall, by the way. That is insane. Uh, we have a long way to go. That's for sure. So, I'm, I'm guessing I'm guessing what's going to happen is they're going to force us as the starter. I'm, I'm assuming. Um, if not, then I don't know what else to say. But uh, let's play out these preseason games, man. Let, let's go ahead and hop into these things. And and uh, see what we can do. Um, I, we're probably not going to... I mean, we're probably not going to play the full game. Uh, so we got to worry about that. Uh, but let's go ahead and hop into the, our first game. First preseason game. And uh, see what we can do. Alright, here we go. First preseason game. And... Uh, So let's get it. Let's see. Let's see how long we play. Uh, see what we can do. It looks like we have full control over uh, over the uh, full playbook here. So that's cool. We're gonna go ahead and run the ball to start things off. Second and eight. This is gonna be a little bit more fun though because of the like. Uh, obviously, it did not end well in uh, NCAA or college football 25. From the 32. I'm going to go ahead and take off here. Go ahead and slide so we don't fumble. 
I wanted to try it though that squeeze that into circle, but I, I just I mean 84 throw power I'm a little bit uh, worried about that And that's exactly why I'm worried so all right well We know our strengths here. We're just gonna be dumping this thing down Nah. Square was getting open, but that was more towards the end. Dot. And he drops it. Okay. Good to know my, my teammates have my back. That's uh that's great. Good to know. Alright, let's move on to our second drive. See if we can do something a little bit better. Um I, uh, I, I don't really know what to say after that first drive. I mean, I, I threw a dot into him, into his, like, right. I mean, he did kind of have to turn around for it, but, uh, but he just didn't hold on to it. So let's see if we can get things going here. The problem is I, I I really like that route that Keaton Allen is running. Um, I just don't I, I just don't I can't I can't really look at it because I don't have the arm power for it. I don't have the accuracy for it. Um, that that's pretty much gonna have to be my game. Uh, get the with the uh, get the quick reads, and uh, let's just dump down and uh, see what we can do. That's an easy play, easy money. I mean that is the read. On that play, so there we go. Another simple completion there. That's all. That's what we got to do. Make it simple. I got. It is funny too, because Caleb Williams is also number eighteen, but uh, Paul Crew is eighteen, so I had to go with eighteen. I could. I could not go with eighteen. I mean, but here we go. To see if uh, Cole Komet's open. No, he's not. But Roma Dunze is. And that is our first touchdown. Let's go. We'll take that. Uh, is in the preseason, so we still got to, you know, take that into consideration. But, uh... It's good to see that, you know. It's good to see that we can still get the ball... To our teammates, I mean, even though they're just short passes, uh, it's good to know that we can still at least get it there. Ah! So it's interesting because in that situation, it gives us a green for throwing it away and not getting sacked, but it also takes away more that is an incomplete pass. So that's interesting. Um... But it, you know it's whatever. So let's uh let's continue to get let's continue to get these yards. Easy money right there. Go ahead and take off. Uh, I think Roma Duze is gonna have a uh, fantastic year this year. Um, Roma Duze and. Uh, and Cole Komet are probably going to have uh, really big years because those are the main two uh, positions that I throw to. Circle was open there, but he was open kind of late. Didn't really have Tom. Uh, so let's see if we can get a pass here. Maybe to DJ Moore would be nice. And throw that to DeAndre Swift. Not quite there. Ah, see, that's the one thing that irritates me as well, man. Let me go for it, right? I, I, if I'm if I'm holding triangle to hurry up, I'd let me go for it. So I think that's gonna do it for our first preseason game. Nice little touchdown, good amount of yardage, good completions, and that's gonna do it for our first preseason game. I think we did all right. Let's move on to the next one. All right, here we go. We got a preseason matchup against the Bengals. And as we saw in the video message from Tyreek Hill, 
uh the grind doesn't stop and it's time to grind once again and see if we can get another dub here in the preseason obviously does not mean much but it'd be nice to get a little bit more work under our wing here so let's get going once again we'll go ahead and start off with another handoff i feel like we didn't run that much in the last the first preseason game we i think we just did that like one rush and that was kind of it so we'll rush a couple more times here i think we might be playing the first half maybe um so we might have a little bit more time to kind of get our yards and touch touchdowns and whatnot so let's go ahead and see what we can do yeah that's an easy money that's an easy money throw on that play love that concept easy concept we'll take it see if somebody can get open here ah you gotta let me go for that coach that's so annoying how is that not a first down i don't understand how that wasn't a first down man that's so annoying dude all right screw the run we are we're, go we're going for it now man boom easy throw to deandre swift good catch from deandre swift uh we already know that deandre swift is a good receiving back so a lot of weapons here in chicago man go ahead dump that down wide open easy first down good read probably could have waited for one of those drags but i feel like that was probably the best read there We'll dump that down. Let's go. Cole commit with the first. Yeah, I I think this I think this team is gonna be a problem, man. I think we we might be a little bit a little bit too good. And, I mean, I I don't want to say anything just yet, but I mean I am playing starters still. Ooh, I thought they were gonna cheat me right there. I don't know what he was doing. Like, how was he not how was he not getting off that? that coverage right there he should have just broke that's a little speed out he should have broke right there but uh that's good cole commit another dump down wish he did i wish he could have uh turned around a little bit faster right there but that's fine let's see if we can get another touchdown here we got one in our first game and we got one in our second game again uh to Roma Dunze again so both of our touchdowns have been to uh been a rookie to rookie connection uh you love to see it that's what we love to see uh Roma Dunze I told you man Roma Dunze Cole Komet you could expect big years out of both of them because uh that is that's who I'm gonna be passing to most so Boom. Roma Dunze once again, like I said. Nice five yard gain. We'll take it. Uh, I might have been able to throw that to X. I might have been able to throw that to Keenan Allen on the out route. I just don't trust my arm right now, man. 84 arm strength, I just feel like is not enough. Gonna we'll take off here. All right, not much going. That's fine. Let's move on. Let's cut our losses from that drive. That wasn't a great drive from the start, anyways. Uh, so we will go ahead and move on. We sh should have another. I don't know. We'll see how long this drive takes. We may have another drive or two potentially. Uh, so let, let's see what we can do. Here we go. Cole commit. Yep, it's exactly who I was looking at. I love the out routes. I love the corners. Unfortunately, we don't have the arm strength to throw the corners right now, but that's why I'm strictly going to work on that uh, that arm that throw power. Let's go ahead and roll out here. Let's go ahead and take off. Easy first down. We'll take it. That's that. That's that speed. Come on now. 
I love to have that speed, especially as a, especially as a uh, field general is kind of crazy, man. I, I still think that's really crazy that you can you can get a field general with a 91 speed. I think that's pretty insane, but I like it, man. I like it. I like the fact that they gave us the option to kind of do what we wanted to do as far as customization goes. Uh, nice out route to Keenan Allen. Keenan Allen's one of the best route runners, so I kind of assumed he would run that pretty clean. I don't. There was nothing really open right there, man. I I didn't like anything right there. I, I didn't like anything right there at all. So, all right, we're moving on. Um. Uh, okay, we're getting another drive, so that's good. I want to try and put two touchdowns on the. If we can at least get. A touchdown per quarter. I think that's exactly where we want to be. Right away, they'll set up to throw. Let's go. Another first down. Don't forget, we can take off. They can't forget. We got the legs too. Now they'll set up to throw. That's a dot. Obviously, we're still a rookie, so we ain't got. And we know we ain't got a swag or anything yet. Uh, so we will obviously get that on as well. But right now, I'm just, we're in the preseason getting this work. That's an easy throw. That should be a touchdown. Yes, it is. Touchdown number two of the day. And look who it is. <laughs> Roma Dunze once again. I'm, I'm telling you, dude. I can already, I can predict it already. They're just, they just, they're in the position to run those clean, good routes. And they normally get open in that, in those positions. So Cole commit always devastating to have a good tight end. And uh, obviously Roma Dunes a in the position he is in. I don't know if I can make that throw, but I'm throwing it. I don't know if I could make it, but I threw it anyways. Let's go. We'll take it. Easy money to Keenan Allen. Now he has his ability, which is uh, max security, I think. So let's go ahead and dump that down to Gerald Everett. Moving pretty well right now. I like I like our pace here. Oh! All right, bad throw. Bad throw for me, but I figured with max security he would actually catch that though. I figured he would. I, I thought he would actually catch that with with his ability, but I guess not. We'll throw that crosser to DJ Moore. DJ Moore's maybe his first completion for me. I don't know. Uh, shout out to him though, former Carolina Panther. Appreciate him. Uh, hopefully he gets more touchdowns than he did with uh, for us. Um, I think the one thing that DJ. I, listen, I loved him. Obviously, as a Panthers fan, I loved him. I really did. Um, but uh, he was a he was a receiving yard merchant. Um, he got over a thousand yards every season, which is really good. But then he would turn around and have like four touchdowns on the season. So um, a little bit mixed emotions on DJ Moore. Hopefully, he has. It could be just be the situation as well. Obviously, he didn't have the best situation in Carolina. Uh, but uh, hopefully he ha does a little bit better in Chicago as we throw our third touchdown to Cole Komet. And uh, that should do it for us here in this one. And, uh, hey, this was even better, man. Good things to come. And uh, I think this is uh, this is nice introduction to our player and uh, we are going to look at our stats here. 18 for 20, uh, 204, three touchdowns, no picks. So we'll take it. Uh, Caleb Williams came in, 9 for 14, 96. Yeah, he's still a stud, but sorry. This is my superstar mode. Um, but that's going to do it for this episode. I think I'm going to end it right there. Uh, if y'all all did enjoy and you're excited, super excited for this series, make sure you drop a like, subscribe, hit that notification as well. And in the next one, we will be starting the regular season appreciate you all till next time i'll see y'all later peace